Hello, dear traders, and welcome back to the Insta TV News channel. Elections to the European Parliament provided weak support for the euro. The pound is flat amid news on the new UK Prime Minister. The euro is trading below 1.12 mark. Investors are unwilling to buy the euro. Eurobloc officials said that in early June they would reconsider their attitude towards Italy. They are inclined to become more demanding to the country with a widening debt crisis. In Austria, the parliament expressed its distrust of the federal chancellor and his government. Thus, Austria has added political tension to the eurozone. The euro slightly changed amid news from Austria. However, the Austrian political conflict is unlikely to have an impact on the market. Today, the eurozone has released data indicating a deterioration in Germany's consumer sentiment. The indicator is at the lowest level in two years, as the Germans are worried about the growth of the country's economy. During the European session, the euro-dollar pair was trading at 1.1193. The overall trend remains downward. The pair should be fixed above the level of 1.1205 in order to catch the bullish momentum. The pound is held in an unusually narrow sideways at 1.2672. Still, the pound-dollar pair is likely to rise, but it's quite difficult to determine which way it will go. If the pair is fixed above 1.2700, it will be the first signal of the buyer's activity. If the growth occurs, it's likely to be episodic. Market participants are focused on who will take the Prime Minister chair in the UK. They are curious about how this person is going to handle the Brexit situation. And this is the defining factor for the pound-dollar pair growth, which should not be overlooked. The dollar versus the franc pair tested resistance on Monday. Sellers of the pair showed a temporary activity. Today, the safe haven asset gave in to the US dollar. Another safe haven asset is also declining despite increased tensions in the US-China relations. Donald Trump said on Monday that he was not ready to make a deal with Beijing and gold is trading at $1,282. Today, the EU leaders will gather for a summit in Brussels. The appointment of a new head of the European Central Bank is one of the major topics. That's all for now. Thanks for watching and see you back soon.